Yo, yo, what's going on? It's your boy, Mr. Locario, the bad boy of the dating game. What's good? So I got an email from a subscriber and the subscriber sent a donation. So thanks for your donation. And remember, guys, if you want to guarantee that your question will be answered, make sure you click the link below and send a donation. So this one says, what's up, Locario? Um, when approaching groups of women in the street or any place women would be in motion, how do you approach the group uh, and talk to the girl you want using direct game? In your audio program, How to Approach Groups of Women, you talk about approaching women in con in the context of bars and clubs. Um, can you go into detail of how you would go about approaching um, these groups of women in the street in motion using direct game? All right. So this is the thing. First of all, I want all you guys to go to badboymembership.com so you can check out my program where I talk about, you know, how to approach groups of women because there's going to be times where you're going to be, you know, at a bar, at a club, or in different situations where you're going to see women in groups, groups of two, three, four, or even more than that, and you're going to know how, you got to know how to approach them. So now you're basically talking about specifically like approaching groups of women in the street while they're in motion, right? Now, for some of you guys who, who, who hate cold approaching, you know, just turn this video off, off right now because this, this is like approaching a group of women in the street while wow, they're in motion, you know, shit like that, that's, that's some next level shit, you feel what I'm saying, like, if you're scared to just approach one chick, <laughs> you know, and holla, this shit ain't gonna, this shit ain't gonna be for you, but anyway, but this is the thing, man, it's, it's, when you're, if you're approaching a group of women, you know, in the street, and in motion, right, that's extremely difficult to do, you understand, because one, you know, when a lot of times when chicks are in motion and they're like, you know, uh, just walking or whatever, and they're just on their way to do something. A lot of times they're in their own, you know, little world. They're in their zone. They're just walking. And then, you know, in a lot of times you can get these chicks to stop and talk to you and all this other stuff. But it's, you know, you have to be very comfortable with approaching women in the street um, to actually approach a group of women in the street. You feel what I'm saying? But basically, this is how you do it, right? Is when you're, if you, let's say you see a group of three chicks, right? And they're walking, right? All you need to do, and this is basically, is basically almost the same thing as you would do if it was sort of just one chick. But the difference is, is that if you see them walking, you just walk with them and talk with them, but you have to acknowledge the whole group. And then you just move into trying to holler at the chick you want to holler at. And what you have to have to have is you have to have cards. You have to have your business cards with your number on it. Because you're not going to be really um, getting the chick's number. You need to just give her your information. Because all of this needs to happen fast. You understand what I'm saying? So you walk with them. You talk with them. You, you, know, you, you acknowledge the whole group. And you give the girl that you want to, you know, holler at your information, which is on your card. So, for example, you see a group of girls walking. You walk, on, you know, right alongside them. Hey, ladies, how y'all doing? That's you acknowledging the whole group, right? And then, then, you know, they'll look at you like, oh, we're good or whatever, right? And then as you're still walking with them, you just go into talking to the girl you want to holler at, right? So... You acknowledge the whole group. Hey, ladies, how you doing? They're like, oh, yeah, we're fine, whatever. And then let's say you got girl A, girl B, girl A, girl B, and girl C, right? And let's say girl A is the one you want to talk to, right? And then you see, so you just go straight into it. You, you say, hey, listen, you know, um, I saw you from across the street. I thought you was really attractive. Here, look, here's my card. I want you to hit me up and, you know, let's get together sometime. And you're just talking straight to the girl that you want to talk to, right? And then after that, you'd be like, you ladies have a good day. And then you keep it moving. That's it. You feel what I'm saying? Now, see, the reason why you got to do it extremely fast in this situation is because they're on the move. You want to get straight to the point. You feel what I'm saying? And then keep it moving. And you need your um, business cards because that's going to be easier for you to get that shit across. Now, in some situations, you can get the girls to stop. And talk to you while you're, you know, stop talk and then, you know, you could probably like exchange numbers that way. But usually that's not going to be the case. Usually they're going to just be in motion doing what they're doing. Right now, the, the, the downside of this situation is this. Is that because 
they're in motion, and because you have to, you know, do the shit fast, right? What happens is, is that you don't have enough time to sort of um, engage with the group and get to sort of know the group so that you can disarm the cock blockers. See, when you approach a group of women in a bar or club setting or whatever, right? It's easier than approaching a group of women on the move in, you know, um, you know what I'm saying? Like just in the street. Because when you're at a bar, and let's say you see a group of three girls or whatever, right? They're just stationary. They're just there. So you have enough time to really chop it up with them. You feel what I'm saying? And so what happens is, is that when you, you know, talk to the girls in a group, and you're, they're stationary and they're there at that bar chilling, right? You get time to get the girls, the other girls that you're not going to be talking to, that's the girl, you know, the girl's friend or whatever, you get them to sort of warm up to you and like, like you. You feel what I'm saying? Which a lot of times disarms them from cot blocking, right? Now, if you're approaching a girl in the street and, you know, a group of girls in the street and you're talking to that girl and you give her your card, what could happen is as you walk away, right, you know, and, and the girls walk away and they're doing, you know, doing their thing, you might have a chick in that group that's going to cock block. One, because you didn't pick her. You feel what I'm saying? And two, because, you know, you didn't have time to really warm up the chick to get her on your side to where she wouldn't really cock block. You see what I'm saying? Because a big component of approaching you know the groups of women is that you have to basically engage with all of them but when you're walking in the street and you see a group of girls in the street you don't have enough time to really do that because they're on the move you see what i'm saying but all you really need to do you know if you're in the street you see a group of girls you know just walk with them talk with them and give your you know your your information to the girl you want to holler at and then keep pushing that's really it you see what I'm saying? And so, you know, a lot of a lot more times you'll you'll probably have more opportunities where you're gonna see groups of women at specific places, like bars, clubs, events, and stuff like that, to where you're gonna, you know, wanna holler at them. And it's a little bit easier in those situations than actually doing it on the street. And if you want to learn more about that, make sure you guys go to badboymembership.com. So you can check out the program and so that you can step up your game. All right. So that's pretty much it, guys. If you have any questions, click the link below and I'll holler at you later. Remember, the truth is inside you. Peace. I'm gone. Click the link below to get the ebook 60 Second Game. In this book, you learn how your confidence, verbal communication skills, appearance, response to rejection and honesty can affect your game. Click the link below to get your copy today. Now, before you turn off this video, I want you to do three quick things. One, I want you to click the link below to send me a question. If you have a question on dating and relationships, I'll make a video about it. Two, I want you to click the link under that to get my free audio program, Undeniable Game, which teaches you seven easy to follow tips on how to really attract beautiful women. And three, I want you to click the link under that one to go to Bad Boy Membership, where you get 45 through 90 minute audio and video dating advice tutorials every month. What's up? It's dating and life coach, Mr. Locario. Go to Bad Boy Membership com and master the dating game by joining my bad boy membership program in this program you'll receive 45 through 90 minute easy to follow step-by-step -step dating advice tutorials that's guaranteed to help you attract date and have sex with beautiful women join the bad boy membership today by going to badboymembership.com that's badboymembership.com